Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be working on the front porch. It's May 2nd and it's high time to get that porch swing up. Uh, behind me here there's a water feature. If you've been following my channel for a while now, you may remember last summer I had done a video on how I did that. I'll link it below in case you want to check it out. But I want to get that thing started. I love the sound of water. I need to hear that out here. So join me as I work on this and enjoy. So for the past number of years we have had a bed swing hanging on our front porch. And I had actually just made it using a piece of plywood and some pine boards. Uh, last year I had done a video on it um, explaining a little more about it uh, in case you're interested in checking it out. I will link it below. But this year I'm going to do something different. We're definitely not going to get rid of our bed swing. I'm sure we're going to use it again. But when I was cleaning out the shop earlier this year, I found this glider rocker that we have had for years. And the base part of it, uh, the wood was kind of rotten, so instead of pitching the whole thing, I decided to just cut out the seat, and I thought it would make an awesome porch swing. Um, it is a little bit wobbly. I think the screws may need tightened up here and there. And this backboard with the engraved flowers, I don't really like. So I think what I'll do is just flip it over so that's on the back side, or just put a new board in. And then, of course, paint the whole thing, and I think it would be kind of fun to decorate it with you know, nice cushions, uh, maybe hang it with a, a rope. Not quite sure yet you know, where I'm going with this, but I just know that for this summer, I want this look instead of a bed swing. And I think it would be a lot easier to take care of. Not as much you know, cushions to wash, and uh, you know, we have our cats, and of course they like the swings too, and everything gets hairy. But I definitely, like I said, we're not getting rid of our bed swing. I'm sure we're gonna put it up again sometime but for this year, it'll be just a seat swing. So the paint I'll be using today is Valsbar brand. It is a semi-gloss exterior white paint. And I will be using my sprayer to apply it. Of course, I will need to mix some water in with it to thin it for my sprayer. Since I was painting with white paint anyway, I decided to repaint the wooden rocker that was on our porch last year. And I had also gotten a little table and chairs for my sister that she didn't want anymore. Um, I had an idea for that to use it on the porch, so I decided to give that a fresh coat of white paint.
Here recently I had done a trash to treasure video where I used an old cable spool, turned it into a table by just using you know the one end for the tabletop, and I still had this other end left over. I knew I wanted to do something with it, and when my sister gave me that little white uh, plastic table, I thought it would add such a perfect little accent for the top. So that's what I'm planning on doing with it. I sanded it down really well and then gave it a coat of polycrylic. These window boxes I had also made last year. I had done a video on it. We'll also link it below. And I decided this year I want them white instead of green. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm using that same white paint I used for all the other items and painting them white. I had gotten these what I call liners for my boxes at Dollar General for a couple dollars last year and I'm able to use them again this year. This year I want to add a mirror hanging on the door above the water feature. I think mirrors are such a great decoration for the outside. Um, it's like if you look into them and you just see double the beauty. You know, there's more green or more blooms or blue sky and I just, yeah, I'm in the mood for mirrors this year. I have this wisteria vine that keeps growing in between the cracks on the deck and I thought this year I'm going to make a little rope wall if you want to call it that. Um, just a little section of rope for it to climb up. I'm not sure is it a good idea or not. Wisterias can be really aggressive but I can always you know trim it down or just cut it off if I get tired of it but I thought it would add a nice little touch of green along the post. I got all of these outdoor pillow covers and the inserts and the blanket from Amazon and I will leave those links below in case you're interested in purchasing them. 
I'm really impressed with them so far. I just love the colors and the quality. The rug is from Walmart. I think I paid maybe $28 for it. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. We are really enjoying our porch. We've eaten out here already and sometimes we just sit here. I'm almost thinking we use it more since it's a seat swing instead of a bed swing. It's kind of easier to sit on. 
I just finished editing the video and I will try to get it published tonight. Thank you so much for watching my videos, guys. Thanks for all the kind comments you leave and all the likes. I really appreciate it. Don't think it goes unnoticed. I hope you all have a great week and I'll see you next time. Bye.